to get ready today and I am going to keep it pretty simple. So I am still using my Saint palette here. It's like my ride or die makeup. We're focusing just on four colors today, keeping it simple, keeping it chill. And I'm even gonna do my eyes with the same four colors. I'm going to start with my cheekbones and just kind of build up. The contour has coverage in it as well and I chose this kind of lighter, warmer contour for me because I'm not planning to do bronzer. Olive is kind of a really good standard for anyone who's like a medium skin tone or lighter. If you have deeper skin tone, then um, indigo is a really nice warm contour that's very forgiving on a lot of people. So I am going to now take my darker highlight color and spot treat. I have these kind of like baby healing blemishes here. Okay, so I have like my coverage on and so now I'm going to switch to this fluffier brush for my lighter color. And I want it down the center of my nose. You can see how much more light that catches. And then I like to kind of like fan this out on the middle. I suggest you brighten where you don't have texture. If you're wanting to use a brightening highlight color, and brighten right there and dab it out. And then again, you can lift and brighten from the outside and then use your finger for precedent. We've been able to accomplish quite a bit of dimension and structure in our face just by using those three colors that we've used. Now I'm just going to take this same contour that I used on my cheeks and I'm just going to use it on my eyes. So same, I just want this contour kind of right underneath to make that bottom lip pop and then a little bit on the edge. And then we are going to grab this cheek color. This is called Tropicana. It's one of my favorites. It's a glossy kind of corally pink color. And I feel like it's just nice and sheer yet still brings a lot. Like you can see how much it grabs the light. And so it makes a big difference without being like really bold. And then I actually want a little bit on my kind of like eyelid, upper eyelid, just to bring in a touch of glow to my eyes. And keep in mind, if you're using creams like this on your eyelids, they will have a tendency to crease, and so I would recommend setting them for sure. But you can use the creams on your eyes as well. Also on my lips, ta-da! And that is like your four colors for your whole face. Thanks everyone for being so great and so wonderful and for making my dream job possible. Without all of you, literally, I would be talking to no one and <laughs> teaching no one and helping no one. So I'm grateful for you and yeah, I hope you know it. And I do love you and I mean it.